Hello everyone. So today we're going to check out how to create a Android app which swipes between the two activities. Now we're going to start with start start a new Android Studio project. Well, and then we're gonna fill out the name. I'll just call it swipe app. Okay, you can choose other stuffs as well I'll just leave all the default as there and when we're here I will only choose the empty activity then go next main activity I'll just leave it just like that and then I'll wait for Gretel to go ahead and create this project well so as you can see Gretel have finished building our project and uh, we have the main activity and activity main.xml uh, we are not going to change anything we are only going to add a little bit of code so I've already written this code up there ahead and paste them there as you can see we have public boolean on touch event this one uh, listen to the touch event if you touch anywhere on your screen it's going to record the uh, location its x and y coordinates so touch events gonna get X touch event is going to get Y uh, we have two cases here if it's action down and action up action down is when you touch action up is when you leave the screen so when the finger touches the screen it's gonna record the location when the finger leaves the screen it's gonna record the location so these are all uh, so we need to declare this x1 and x2, x1, y1, x2, and y2. Uh, we're going to declare them here. So let's go very fast because we don't know this. They can be float x1, x2, y1, and y2. All right. So um, now uh, when somebody, uh, when you leave the screen, we are going to make some decision if it's less than x2 that means it will be uh, from left to right okay if we put it if we change this to greater than that that, that will be from right to left so for today we are, we are only uh, interested in testing if the touch is from left to right so now here uh, we don't have this activity as yet swipe left so I'm going to create it right away so um, new activity empty activity and I'll give it a name swipe left okay and now we're gonna wait for Grado to finish building this all right so as you can see here swipe left with Java and its activity have already been um, made here so uh, and this error goes away so what thing that you only need to add here is this one here and also remember to declare the variables here all right so now we're good to go we are going to test this on our emulator all right so as you can see gradual finish building so you can use all those x and y position to, de to detect if it's a uh, uh, left to right or right to left or up and down whatever swipe event you can just use only this code right here you can, you can add an if statement here statements here to detect if x is greater than x2 x1 is greater than x2 to detect all those moments so that's it for today I'll see you next time bye bye